From the Blackboard homepage, featured within the Blackboard tile on Udo, you'll be able to see each of the modules you are enrolled onto by selecting the module section in the left-hand menu. You can identify your current modules and past modules by using the drop-down list in the center of the screen or the left and right-hand arrows. You can also change the layout view and filter your modules using the search. Each module will have its own unique homepage, similar to the way the program homepage is laid out, with a menu on the left-hand side which contains your module information as well as contact information which will provide details of the allocated academic for this particular module. Module Home, featured in the left-hand menu, will return you to the module homepage, where you'll find announcements and reminders of your assessment deadlines, making it easier to manage your workload. As with the program page, we recommend that when you join or return to a module, you catch up on any announcements or messages. It can be useful to work through these from the oldest to the newest. You will access the study material section most often. This is where you'll find your learning content and activities for the module. At the top of the page is a welcome, which will outline the information to be covered, as well as the learning objectives and the module assessments. Below the module welcome, there is a list of folders called units. Your module is split into units so that you can go through the content in easier to digest sections of information, usually one unit per week. You'll also find a printable version of your units featured at the end of the unit list. Each unit will contain an introduction followed by the unit content, within which you'll find a variety of material, such as web and document links, videos, audio files, and diagrams. And you will be asked to undertake various activities and tasks as you work through the content. Towards the end, you will find a unit summary and an end of unit activity. And you can navigate around the unit by selecting a section in the table of contents or by clicking the arrow in the upper right hand corner to move on to the next page. You can choose to hide the menu on the left hand side of the screen by hovering your mouse over the right hand side of the menu and selecting the arrow to hide it and then select it again to bring it back. To complement the study material, you'll find your online reading list featured within the left hand menu. Your online reading list will contain the core text for your module, the required reading for different units, as well as any further reading and additional resources. From the UDO homepage, you can also select the library tile and have access to the University of Derby's online library to conduct your own independent reading and research. In the left-hand menu of the module page, you'll find the social learning area. In here, you will find a link to your module discussion boards. These are used for general discussions, questions and activity-based discussions. You will also find your personal journal, which you can use to reflect on your learning and to complete activities where indicated in the module units. You will also access Blackboard Collaborate, where you can access live online seminars, which will be conducted throughout your course. By attending online seminars, you'll be able to meet virtually with your academics and interact with your peers as if you are physically in a lecture theatre or workshop together. Your academic will let you know in advance when they are running these sessions, but do not worry if you cannot attend, these sessions are recorded, so you can watch them later. When needed, you will also find a groups section. In here, you'll be able to access any module groups your tutor may have allocated you to. This is a space where you'll interact, collaborate and demonstrate your knowledge with fellow students in your allocated group, just like a breakout room. The details of your assessment requirements for your module can be found within the assessment section in the left hand menu. This will include your assessment brief, submission points and assessment information. It covers a lot of important information relating to submissions and assessments, so please ensure you read the information available here. All modules follow the same kind of format, so once you've navigated around one, you'll know exactly what you're doing. If you're unsure about something, then you can use the search function on Udo to search for answers or visit the FAQ tile. For any IT related inquiries, visit the IT support tile where you'll find information to get help and support 
and articles to help troubleshoot any problems. Your academic or module lead can help you with any specific inquiries about your program or module and their contact information can be found within the contact section on your program or module page. The online learning advisor team should be your main point of contact for any non-academic questions which cannot be answered by searching on Udo. Their contact information can be found via the contact tile featured on Udo. Good luck with your studies here at the University of Derby Online Learning.